<coughs> Hello viewers, welcome back. Today I wanted to show you how I design these magnetic motors. So yeah, you can see I use an AutoCAD and that is a pretty long lasting and boring job. But let me show you and how it's really interesting to me and I enjoy doing this because of course it gives me some money from YouTube and that's the one of the purposes I do that. But the other is that I actually do some serious job here because uh, you know, not there are too many channels which are making just fake videos of some free energy generators uh, which cannot of course work. But these generators, well, what I designed, these are the, the patents which are maybe don't work but they are actually real patents which you can find on Google Patents page. Yeah? So for example this is the new this is the new magnetic motor I'm working on. You will see it is I think genus James James magnet motor. It's very interesting and, and you will see um, it's very complicated and uh, that's why I did not make it any sooner than that. But how I actually do these things, yeah. So as as you know, I always put in description the when I have the patent uh, original patent, I put in description down below uh, the link. And basically, I find this original. So this is the genus James magnet motor I'm working on right now. It's very very complicated motor as you can see. There are some images available and based on these images I create a 3D model in Autodesk. Autodesk AutoCAD. Yeah? And that's it. And of course uh, there is uh, when you come to... Uh, you can even download the whole pattern, the whole pattern with description. So there are some drawings here and on the bottom there is a complete description how this should work yeah so can it really work we would have to try but basically here is described often in 10 pages even more how this every piece of this uh, machinery how it's supposed to work yeah so can it really work we have to try yeah but again it would be a big problem even if we want to try yeah we don't have the exact measures I did not see in any patent available on the Google patents page that has real measures. You need 23 millimeter magnets or something like that. So that's that's the biggest problem. Yeah? And um, this is the just representations. My, my drawings are representations how these devices look like to encourage you maybe to try to experiment by yourself or I don't know, do something or just learn how magnet motors or just the usual motors work yeah so basically it's very similar yeah the magnet motor and the, and the permanent magnet motor which is run by electricity it's not far away one from from the another yeah but just the problem is to to solve the opposing magnetic field in magnet motors yeah so you will see very soon i think in in 2 days i will be finished with this uh, this new motor which is very interesting i have to say and uh, yeah, this is my small setup I use uh, for all what I do and video editing and then the, and the drawings. And yeah, I simply enjoy to do this. So thank you for watching. So just wait for this new patent and I'll come back pretty soon. Bye bye.